Me and my friends were living our lives successfully in the great Yukon. One day after a bad accident, we were flown to the state of New York. We have no idea where we are, where we come from, and what we need to do. Find out with us what will happen. Thanks to G Portal for hosting today's game. All right, we got to go into town, bud. All right. It's a nice looking one. They said it should be around the corner on the right. On the right. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay. You see how many doors this thing has? Three doors. Okay. And a tailgate. That's a lot of moving parts. Yeah. You know what else it is? Probably expensive. Yeah, I think this is like where we need to be as a business, being able to buy this stuff and flip it. No, what we need to be at is where we're taking trust to have four doors and then adding the extra doors. Because I don't know That's about you, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't afford to do this one. I no. guarantee we go ask this guy, he's going to want like forty, fifty thousand dollars $50,000 for this truck. We only got 7000 for our name. <laughs> I bet it's more than that. Hold on, you want to go find out? Yeah, let's go find out. All right. Thank you. 50,000 is what he's wanting. Yeah. Was, will you hold it for a couple months? Months? We need years. I, I, I think we uh, go home. I think it's time yeah, to go let's... home and go to bed, and then we need to go find Happy. You know we got to return this tomorrow, right? Yeah, that's not a road. Then that's a house. That's not our house. <laughs> Can I say, Chris, I think it's about time for us to get a new house. I'm tired of living over here. Maybe separate rooms? <laughs> yeah. I'm tired of cuddling up, waking up, cuddling up to Happy. Is he in the truck? Oh, he does know how to come back. About time you guys showed up. Okay, we can't help it. You took our only truck. Well, that was my fault, remember? Yeah, You yeah, also have the keys fault. to the house here. I can't get in. That was your own dumb fault. How was the date? I don't want to talk about it. Oh, okay. Let's go to bed. The next morning. Boys, I think we should today, this morning, before we go to work, even though we, I know we got a lot of work to do, I think we should go look for a new house. What do y'all think? Do I get my own room? Listen, I'm tired of cuddling up to you like you are me, okay? Yeah, Can we let's take do those that. Uh, trailers we saw next to... Honestly, I think it'd be cheaper, because three separate houses, that's going to cost us a lot more money. One house with three bedrooms probably runs about two grand a month. I'm down with that, I guess. But we cuddled. If you want, you can stay here. I ain't staying here. Well, you're like, I guess. You're starting to press to leave if you want you stay i want to get my own trailer oh uh, still got them blue okay he's still in the blues yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. i think he's still sad yeah I said i don't want to talk about it how about this one right here this has to have three bedrooms in it if nothing else we can let happy sleep in the living room it'll, it'll work does it have a backyard yeah yeah we need to make sure it's a backyard so happy can mow it that's a pretty good backyard don't you think it's a pretty good backyard yeah you know a realtor around here or what do we what do we do well, what we can do is we just call him up after while we're working with mr anderson and we'll find out how much it costs if i had to guess two thousand that's a third of our paycheck we got the new business going so hopefully there'll be more money coming in for the trucking all right boys we gotta get to work we got work we gotta do today i hope i don't get a ticket i ain't seen a cop in weeks after the last disaster unless you just dump them off on the river I'm happy i heard that well i didn't say anything Chris! Chris! Woo, trickster is he dead i meant to do, do that his money wow okay you know what drop me off here hello yeah uh, yes, sir. This is he. Chris, happy. You on radio? Yes. Hey, I need to talk to y'all when I get there. So, I got goodish news, boys. Apparently, we own another vehicle. Wait. What? Bro, you know how we ended up in the hospital and we don't really remember a whole lot? Yeah, is that about my painful headache? Yeah, we, well, we got those occasionally. Apparently, we owned a pickup truck, a trailer, and a Kubota skid steer. And so, we don't have to pay for it or anything? It's just our, ours? We, well, we have to pay for the shipping, which for shipping was 4000 like I said. That's Chris? not terrible. What are we doing? Oh, are you going to talk to the boss? Oh, uh, yeah, I'll talk to him. All right, thank you, Mr. Anderson. And I'll totally give him the cookies. So Cookies? Cookies, give me them. No, 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 he had no cookies. He's lying, okay? He's old. He's getting dementia. By the way, Mr. Anderson don't look like he's doing too good, boys. We ain't, get, we ain't paid to worry about that. So we need to be concerned about what's going on now. So okay. we got to get going with planting soybeans and planting corn. I can do the soybeans. Okay, yeah, you can go do the soybeans. Um, I'll do the corn. What's Happy doing? I'm going with Mr. Anderson to look at a, uh, a cattle farm. Let us know how that goes. Don't spend all our money. Yeah. Remember, we need four grand of it to pick up that delivery. I'll leave you four grand. Yeah. Later. I'm done over here. How are you doing over there? I'm gonna be a minute, but it's coming along nice. All right, I'm on my way over there. I just got I just got everything switched over to soybeans, so we'll go ahead and get yours knocked out, buddy. You heard anything from Happy yet? Not a peep. I'm sure he's busy uh, planning his empire. Uh, I'm gonna ask you a question, Chris. Are we sure we want to allow him to start up a cattle farm? My perspective is he said he got his own loan, and uh, if he's successful, it's on him. If he fails, it's on him. All right, and then we kick him out to the curb and tell him Renton's doing the first. Okay. Hey, Chris, how you doing over, bud? You just about to finish up here. All right, I'm going to start heading on back towards the house. All right, I just got a little area I missed over here to finish up, and I will be right behind you. Well, Chris, 
I think they're here. You think? Yes, let's go ahead and unstrap it. I mean, and go ahead and pay the man the four grand, by the way. There we go. Watch out for the... Oh, that was close. Well, apparently we own this. I feel like I remember this Kubota from somewhere. Let me sit in it. Oh, okay, you sit in it. Does, it. does it bring any memories back? I can tell you've been in here. There's a lot of wrappers everywhere. It's dirty as all get out in here, though. It's, like, it's almost like this has been used for dirt pushing. You're saying something about gold well i know they do a lot of gold up in the yukon i mean have you never watched the tv show gold rush if this came from the yukon and we were in the yukon why didn't we just stay in the yukon like why, why were we flown back to the yukon after everything because we're u.s citizens probably <sighs> true not gonna lie it's actually a really nice truck but you know what this is perfect this gives you me and happy each our own truck i mean at least we got a kubota now i mean this might come in handy because i know you're wanting to open up like some kind of like place like camping area this might come in handy like clear land with it definitely would and i Gosh, clear land. Gosh, that sounds familiar. I mean, who knows? Well, the only thing I know is we gotta get back to work. One extremely annoying shift later. All right, Chris. I guess Happy said we need to come up there and look at his new project. I'm excited to see it. Can't wait for Happy to see that truck and skid steer to see if it rings a bell with him. But let's get down there. I think this is it over here, bud. Oh, there is a little opening there. Okay. Ooh, a cornfield. Hold on, hold on. Mr. Anderson owns part of this? God dang it. That means more corn we have to harvest. Oh, there he is. Holy moly. Wow. I now I need to know how much of a loan he got for this. Hey guys, what's Holy up? Moly. Hi. Hi, how are you? Pretty We're good. Here. We We're just closed on it. Okay, how much sure? did you end okay. up spending? A little over seven hundred thousand dollars. That ain't that bad. Alright, uh, show us the no. sh show us the place. We got this main dairy barn here. We'll have most of the cows in there. We got this bale shed over here. Up here we've got this building here, which will be a uh, shelter for the cows in this pasture. Got a nice pasture back here for them to roam. Got another uh, dairy barn here, main barn for equipment, wow. two silos for silage. I'm sure you guys saw the cornfield on your way in. Mm -hmm. Yep. That'll be for silage. We'll chop that so you don't have to harvest that, Nate. I heard you complaining about that. How? I just want to point this out. Whoever did this didn't uh, compact this side too well, did they? I think that's for, you know, when winter comes and it expands and, you know, that's that's, that's yeah. a oh, drainage uh, a, thing. A, so, a design. So it'll, okay. Yeah, no, so it'll drain this way out. Yeah, that's what I that's what I've heard. Totally not trying to save Happy. I'm not an expert, but I, I, I'm I, pretty sure I saw a snake in this tall grass. You should probably cut it. That man picks up a snake right now. I'm going towards the truck, and I ain't coming back for him. I am never picking up a snake. Pretty nice out here, Happy. Huh. You did a pretty good job. Just don't jump in here, right? Because you could... I don't want to get mixed. Hey, 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 come right here. Okay, happy. Uh, All right, Chris. Uh, uh, Let's help you up. Let's get you in there. So when's the funeral? Uh, well, I mean, we don't have to say it's a funeral. I mean, just feed to the cow and feed to the pigs. We'll be fine. Oh, oh man, yeah, he yeah, made yeah. it out. Yeah. Ah, shit. Yeah, it wasn't on. Hang on, uh, boys. I don't know much. I'm tired. We've worked a lot today. And I just, I did get the call back, by the way, Chris, while we were waiting for Happy to tell us that he, everything got finalized, that it is going to be $2,500 a month. So I just, I think we take all the money from Happy's paycheck and then me and you, Chris, will split uh, $250 a month. How's that sound? By the way, Happy, uh, do you remember at any point in our lives having a Kubota? It's good to not it. really. It's not ringing a bell. All right, let's go back to the farm and we'll yeah, let you yeah. see it. Okay, man. All right, Happy. Does this is running bells to you oh my gosh i remember 